Konnichiwa Mina. It's 1839, the final year of the 1830s. As we just won, we about beat Kiva and conquered it in the last episode. And we're starting to colonize this part of, um... Um, if... Tajikistan, perhaps? I can't quite remember. There's so many of those stands in the area. But we're supposed to get it by, um, June 7th. And, of course, if I'm correct, we almost about the... Okay, so it's 70, so it's still a while to go before we can, um, sphere, um, Persia. And hopefully soon we can kick Krakow out of, um, Austria's hands. Ooh, I can see a sipping right here. Let's see, what can I do? Oh, Moldovia. Alright. Increase our opinion with them. Hopefully soon we can kick them out of the Ottomans' control. Oh, yeah, speaking of which, too, if I got paused... I was, last time I tried to build a, um... A um, lumber mill somewhere around here. Yeah, yes, it is. this is the um, province. But it require. But remember, lumber mills require a shit ton, as you can see, of timber. Which I'm sure the province provides a lot, but oh boy, that's required way, way, way too many. So I think I'm actually gonna do furniture instead. But the problem is that requires um, the l timber already made. So I think I'll do paper mill instead, even though it requires a wee bit more. Cur ah, fuck, I did the wrong province. Alright, so... How the fuck did I get the right, wrong province? It's supposed to Okay, okay, I got, yeah, I got wrong now. But where the hell... I think this is it. Yeah, this is it. That, that was the province... It's this one. That was the province I was working on last time. This is the province I was supposed to go for. And it's nice to see that in the... I guess in the most recent update for Victoria 2, if you um, build a factory but close it down after you built it by accident like I just did, you get your full money back because before that was not the case at all. You would get, lose all that money. So that's a nice plus to be able to get all that money back so I can rebuild it somewhere else. Alright, still, um, let's see. Alright, looks like they've hit maximum craftsmen somewhere. Alright, Kiev, I'm not going to upgrade you because you're struggling big time. So instead... Okay, Curse is already okay. Yeah, it's on our air. So, Kazan, I guess, take the um, prop, um, focus off of Kiev and go there instead. Alright, so we got till um, June 7th it was before we could finally colonize it. Ah, oh, man, Austria kicked us out of crack up again. Damn it! That's just great. And I think I'm going to finally increase education spending all the way. Increase administration spending. And increase defense spending a bit because our, um, our brigades are so low compared to our um, how many troops we have right now. Oh, Portugal wants an alliance. All right. Ah, this again. Yeah, do it. They're going to be pissed, but hey... Of course, I don't have, um, um, enough money to do rare- Oh, that's right, I haven't unlocked railroads yet. Don't really have enough to do forts yet, either. I hear troops being built now. Alright, so, fix the relationship with the British for one final time and focus on everyone else soon after that. Alright, we'll increase, um, administration again and defense as well. Alright, so Okay, everything's going okay for right now. Let's see. How are they doing? Kiev. Wow, Kiev looked like they've lost a... Okay, just two. Moscow, they're still working on it. The curse. Oh my god, a whole year? Two years, pretty much, to build that um, paper mill factory. Oh my god, that's ridiculous. Just a couple just a couple more weeks and I can finally um, colonize that territory. Increase their spending it once again. <clears throat> It'll take a while still before I can build the um forts, I mean um, naval bases. One more week, one more week. Come on, come on. I think actually on this game though, on this most recent version, it doesn't happen on stuff. It happens. In oh, there we go. <laughs> we finally got it. All right, but we can't colonize that for a while. So it's nice we got a lot bigger. All right, so now um. Of course, we can't go to war with anyone for a long time now, so we have way too much infamy. How much would it cost to go... Oh, that's right, we have, already have a truth defense, I can't check. I could probably check Persian. Oh, they have too much of alliance. Be good relationship with Afghanistan. Damn. 
Need someone who's too... Who's big... Ooh, goody! Oh, Montenegro now! Let's see if trying to keep... I don't think we can steer them yet, though. Where are they at? Oh, they're neutral. Well, now they're cordial. Let's see, how much... Let's try the Ottoman Empire. If they're not too happy or not. How much would it cost to take us? Eleven, then... What am I thinking of? Oh, demand concession I'm thinking of. I think that's only for, um... Uncivilized nations. Let's try Egypt and see what happens. There it is. Five. Okay, so... I demand concessions only for uncivilized nations. Which, down here... That's possible. Cookland, that's actually still possible, because I think they're still small enough, I mean, too big to take about one um, battle, conquest, like it was for Kiva. Oh, there's a whole bunch of troops right here. Go up here. Alright, so now, um, or some troops right here. Assuming, right? Increase assumination. Assimilation, I meant to say. Yeah! Fuck yeah! Do that. Alright, increase. Administration spending and military spending too. All right, so now um, France is good, Prussia is good, the U.S. Uh, not so much, but who cares? They're so f I actually know they're no, they're, they're not bored yet. Although I think there's an event. I think oh, I think the U.S. can only do it though to get to buy Alaska off. But I think that's only an event the U.S. can. I don't think Russia can do that. Nor would I want to sell, um, Alaska off. Okay, a thousand, uh, eight hundred air. And, um, two, a thousand or eight in curse, that's good. Man, Moscow's gonna take it forever to get workers. Uh, I was about to say, eh, maybe they could finally, ah, uh, damn, Austria kicked us out of crack oh, again. I was about to say, hmm, Kiev's looks like they're starting to finally do good, but then all of a sudden, nope. Do it in the, in the gutter again. And, damn it, they're not making money again. I don't think I'm building any more clippers, though. I mean, I'm ships, though. Am I? No. <laughs> okay, no, no, no. All right. Hmm. Wonder where that supply shit's coming from, though. But damn it, I gotta cut spending. Cut the damn military. And get back up to fifty percent. No, not fifty-one. Fifty. Got another diplomatic point. All right. So, um. Oh man, we felt the third. Just great. I was just, I said, um, in the last episode, we probably will fall to the third place to the French again. We did just that. Alright, so, um, man, <laughs> oh, man, working on all the railroads and all the forts in Russia, that's going to be such a pain in the ass. Alright, let's see, though, um, well, there'll be really no point to do the forts over in Alaska right now because we're not, there's no one really going to take us over there. The only place I had to worry about is Prussia and Austria and the Ottoman Empire, pretty much. Oh, we could do another, um, spear at someone. Oh. Well, I can always keep forget how it's pronounced. Wallisia? Or Wallachi or something like that. I can't ever fucking remember. I, keep, I need to watch the Great War again to find out how, how it's pronounced. And as soon as I watch it, I'm going to fucking forget it again because I'm an idiot. Alright, now we're making a good ton of money. But, um, I think it costs like 11 pounds. Oh, 12. Great. But hey, we can get them built up right here, perhaps. I might do that when we get enough more money at the moment. Just wait a bit, though. Increase um, administration again a bit. As we're almost near the end of the year. And we'll move you closer. Oh, I think that was a naval base being built. Oh, that's the factory. Nope, the factory's still gotta take a while. Ah, man, Austria, I mean, Prussia kick us out of Denmark again. Damn it. Yep, it's the base is being built as they're going up a bit, and it's just a new year. <laughs> nice. And speak of the devil, I think it was built over here, hopefully. Yes! Yes, it was built over here. Alright, so I can increase our, the amount of shit we could build here. Alright, build a man of war. And they build a commerce rate. I think they're all just clippers. Oh, no, frigates, I meant to say. And of course, let's see our spheres of influence, how they're doing. Oh, man, there's still a while to go still for Krakow and Persia. Man, they're taking way too long. Hey, um... Oh, no, no, we need 100 to get um friendly with Sweden. So other than that, can't do anyone at the moment. 
But let's start working on our um, forts. Of course, close that out. Build one right here. There still needs to be an imp let's see if the infrastructure page got updated in the most recent version. Ah, no. If Paradox Games is watching, they really need to build a um a map mode where you can see like the forts and stuff being built, so you know what's being built and what's not being built, what levels they at, make it much easier. Because oh my god, I mean they have one for railroads, which is the infrastructure page. What, what was this? Looked a little bit different. I saw something. Ah, uh, no, 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 that wasn't it. Oh, administration. Okay, never mind. I mean, because we have a map for railroads, we have a map for naval. Why the hell don't we have one for forts? Because I mean, the forts are pretty big too, especially the biggest like expense. So Paradox Games, if you're watching, please make a map mode or something that we know where the forts are at. All right, but that was it for the 1830s, and I got all the Poland part right here. Starting to work on forts, but it's gonna take a long ass time for the build because oh. Oh, oh, oh my god. Build up all the forts and rush is going to be forever. And then, of course, remember, I got to do level 2, level 3, level 4, and so on. And I remember, um, like, the last round of forts I did it in, um, in my Ottoman Empire playthrough, which I, pre I had almost the entire Arabian, um, um, Arabian, um, Arabian Peninsula, and pretty much, like, a shit ton of Africa. That cost, like, 2 million pounds for the last round of upgrades. And, oh boy... I got even more provinces than I'm going to have in that game. And, of course, right off the bat, too. Oh, jeez, that's going to take forever. In terms of money and time to make, too. But hopefully the 1840s will be very successful as the 1830s have been so far. So, Johnny.